What is up, guys? It is Nick. We are back, and my chair is squeaking. I, I love this chair, but man, it squeaks. All right, enough about that. All right, so we are redeeming our Hall of Fame stuff now, pre-order content. So let's hop into this. What I'm about to get, one of the things I'm about to get is about the dumbest thing they've ever done in Ultimate Team, okay? Like, it's not stupid, okay? It just doesn't make any sense. Okay, so we got pre-order training pack, we got custom uniform, cover athlete pack, Hall of Fame fantasy pack, Team Elite Fantasy Pack and Gold Team Fantasy Pack. We're going to start out by opening this up. I don't know. To me, in my opinion, this makes no sense. Why are we giving everybody 89 overall Antonio Brown? Like, I'm I'm not going to argue with the fact that I got Antonio Brown for free, but... I mean, come, come on. We're all getting it. That makes... If I pull, like, 89 Antonio Brown out of a pack, he's worthless. Everybody already has him. Like, there's no there's no point to him. That's just my opinion. I think it's a really dumb thing. They should have given us, like, an 84 or an 85 overall one. Would have made far more sense. Ooh, 350 training. Yes, please. Uh, but that is... That's just my opinion on it. Um, it's nice that we all get it, and uh, we all get a really good wide receiver. But it just doesn't make any sense to me in the terms of, like, overall... Why? Why are you giving us all this? I don't know. That's just my opinion. It kind of absolutely destroys... There's no point to even try to pull it. Like, if you pull Antonio Brown, who cares? I'm going to open up Falcons and Jags, I think. I may open up a couple Texans. But I want to get that Julio Joe. Oh, Alex, a Mac. Let's go. 86 overall. That's a nice. I want to get that Julio. Potentially, maybe the Jalen Ramsey. I'd probably sell Ramsey, but I want Ramsey. Uh, so I think I'm going to do, after after careful consideration of 10 seconds, I'm going to open up 5 Jags, 5 Falcons, and 2 Texans. But that's a really nice start with Alex Mack. Power up. <laughs> it's the troll. They gave me the Jalen Ramsey power up. Okay. I mean, it's close. It's kind of what I asked for. They'll probably give me the Julio power-up next. You know that's coming. Alright, here we go. Here's the Julio Jones power-up. <laughs> we pulled Edo Smith twice now. Alright. What are we gonna go? Let's go with the Texans one now. Then we'll go back to the Jags. Cause this has Clowney, it has Watt. Has DeAndre Hopkins. I think the Eagles one, if you want to open up one, the Eagles one has the most elites. I believe the Eagles have the most elites per team. Uh, so if you want to open up that one, that one gives you the most elites chance, like highest chance of an elite. I'm open up this, and then we're going to open up two Jaguars in a row. So we've pulled one elite. We pulled the Alex Mack. All right, I'll take Calvin Ridley's. I'll take Calvin Ridley. I'll take I'll take those. Uh, uh, okay, well we went out of order, so we're going with the elite team fantasy pick. This is just yeah, this is just this. Um, I already took Julio once. Um, what do I need? Mm, I could use an maybe Joey Boat, maybe Miles Garrett. We might take Miles Garrett. I don't need a wide receiver. I already have my wide receiver court planned out. It's either... I don't even think there's linemen as an option. I'd probably take a lineman if it was an option. Yeah. Um. Yeah, it's probably going to be Bosa. Or... Right now it's Bosa. Maybe Sean Lee. Can I look at Sean Lee's stats? What are Sean Lee's stats? 74 speed... What are Sean Lee's coverage stats? Uh, okay. I can live with those. Maybe Sean Lee. Mm. I think I'm going to go with Miles Garrett. Who do I have at right end right now? Um, Alright, yeah, I think I was using a gold. Yeah, I'll take Miles Garrett, I think. Ah, it's so hard. I'm going to take Miles Garrett. I'm going to take Garrett. 
Alright, we got seven more of these to go. Let's just get the Texans out of the way. We'll be done with the Texans, then we'll do two Jags in a row. <clears throat> Alright, give me that JJ Watt. Oh, oh, we got Deshaun Watson. We got an elite, but it's Watson. It's not bad, though. I'll take I'll take any elites out of these. These are essentially free packs, so if they want to give me anything, I'm cool with it. All right, so now we gotta do two jags. Time to get another power up, Jalen Ramsey. Mm-hmm. Two golds. All right. After this, we're looking at like two. I'm, I might go back to the, might go back to the Texans again one more time. Sacrifice the Jags, because if I pull a bo a Boye, or, oh my gosh, AJ Boye, if I pull a Boye, let me learn how to talk. Here it is. Right oh, you nicking Gakwe. I'll, I'll take it. I'll take any elites out of this. But you know, when you're when you're pulling these ones where there's like crazy cards in it, like the Jags, where you can pull Boye, and you can pull Ramsey. There's some, just, just a little tilting when you don't pull them as your elite. The Mac was great. I'm happy about the Mac. Come on, give me that Julio Jones. Oh, it's right here. Julio. Okay, another Devontae Freeman. The Falcons pack has been nice to me. We might just keep pulling Falcons packs at this point. They have been nice. Freeman and and Mac. <laughs> I keep pulling Edo Smith. That's like the fourth Edo Smith I pulled. All right, what do we want to do? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go Jags. One Jag. One Falcons. Right here. Right here is the Jalen Ramsey. It's coming right here. I pulled a corner. I pulled a corner whose name is not Jalen. I pull I pull a cornerback whose name is Jalen, just not Jalen Ramsey. I'm happy pulling any stuff for the Jags because their diamond is Jalen Ramsey, so I might actually consider doing their diamond and just have Boye and Ramsey. Alright, here we go. Falcons. End it off. Let's walk. Can we walk it off with a Julio Jones? Just walk it off with Julio. Right here. Final card. Walk it off. Julio. Oh. Oh, oh my. Oh, my Edo Smith. Get out of here, Edo. All right. Hall of Fame fantasy pack. We got Dan Marino. Don't need you. Terrell Davis. I consider Terrell Davis T.O., considering T.O. The Erlacher, okay, so my issue with Erlacher is, okay, so, like, the biggest issue I have with Erlacher is the fact that he's so incredibly slow once you, like, even if I power him up, he's so incredible. It, it's between Rod, it's between Rod and T.O., and my point with this is, is that probably, probably, we will get... A, a rod will get a rod sooner than we'll get a T.O. And I really don't have my wide receivers fully fledged out. Like, I want Brandon Cooks and I want Tyreek Hill. But do I really need Randy Moss or does, will T.O. get the job done for me? Like, I like T.O. just as much as I like Randy Moss, so I'm not sh quite sure it really matters. Rod Woodson is just the god, but look, 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 look at my corners. Do I really need him? I did the power up Boye, all the way powered up Boye, all the way powered up Slay. Champ is in an 87. I can't get Champ any higher because they screwed me with Champ. I mean, I'm going to take T.O. for now with the understanding that I might spend whatever it is to get more of these. I think it's like 20 bucks. I don't know. Like, I, I might buy the upgrade. But there's the T.O. Let's look at the upgrades for these things. So, you can get him to an 85 overall. So, Rod wouldn't even start. Like, if I power up this T.O. all the way, he can at least start. So, let's power the T.O. up. I mean, we're here. Let's power him up. Let's get this T.O. to a playable level on my team. We got 350 training. We'll use it all on T.O. here. So, we got 85 T.O. He can actually play on my team. 
So, um, I don't actually know. I'm going to leave it because I don't know what I want with him yet. Uh, balanced offense, power run, play fake. Probably, probably go deep, but I don't actually know yet. These are so incredibly expensive. Um, you probably want Sprinter overall because then you need to boost your speed to some crazy heights. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to leave those blank for now. I'll edit them, but we can take a look at his stats now. They get him to 85. So he's got 81 speed. That's not, that's an, that ain't no Moss level speed. Uh, I'd actually compare him to Moss. I have like an 82 Moss, or I have an 84. I have an 84 Moss. Um, catching is an 83. E, e, this card is E. This card is okay. E, e. It's okay. It's okay. It, it'll get the, it gets the job kind of done. Uh, but we'll compare them. I have a Moss. I have 84 Moss. Um, oh, I totally forgot about Antonio Brown, because he, he's definitely starting on my team, but, uh, so I don't actually have... Tyreek anymore, so I might just not buy Tyreek anymore. Uh, I mean, not buy him, but I might, I don't know, he might just be my third, or my fourth receiver that just returns bunts and kicks at this point. Um, but there's the Moss. Obviously, the Moss is faster. It's got some better catching stats, strength. Alright, alright, not not that bad of a card. That T.O. That T.O. will work paired up with Antonio Brown. Okay, I'm okay with that. Uh, but that's gonna do it, guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Drop a like if you did, subscribe if you haven't, and uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one where I'm not entirely sure. Or they release new packs. They give us new packs. No. I bought this featured one. It was a load of crap, so I didn't upload it. <laughs> yeah, you guys didn't need to see that. It was some. It was some hot garbage. I pulled like Blake Bortles, and that's about it. I pulled pulled Blake Bortles and like two other eighty elites and so yeah i i think you guys need to see that so that's gonna do it for this episode guys i'll catch you guys in the next one peace out